welcome back to the channel everyone you know, if you guys have been following there are three glyph puzzles that can be solved in the Valundra forge using different weapons that you acquire through the three different forges now with the bow that we get from the izami forge we can now get marin's vision now in order to get this you are going to need the spiteful fang bow that you get from the izami forge and you are going to be using it to shoot hidden glyphs around the actual forge itself now the first step is to find this butterfly that I'm standing on now and then shoot the falling glyphs in the same order that I shoot them in. For the first set there's going to be two, then you're going to look behind you towards the entrance and you're going to see this sun kind of emblem and you're going to have to move and stand on it and shoot these next set of glyphs. And take note that the first one in the second set needs to be shot twice. Once finishing this puzzle, you're going to get the emblem, which is used to unlock the crest beacon that you find laying around the Valunder Forge. Now for this one here, you're going to be able to activate the crest beacon in the back of the cave area. Now there are going to be two more of these beacons to activate. One is going to be used with the heavy machine gun that you get from the forge, and the other one with the sniper. I will have a link down in the description below and showing you how to get those two. Now upon activating all three of these crests, you get another message that pops up, and of course it needs to be decrypted. Now the message can be found right behind the forge on this kind of broken TV screen it looks like. Now once decrypted, this reads out to, with eyes fixed, past dawn's end, the fourth flame will rise, bring the knowledge obtained to the raiders of secrets, still thyself. Now what does this mean? I'm not sure, but now that there are three of the forges, maybe those count as three flames, and we know that there is another forge that Bungie has no release date on, so maybe this is the beginning to getting that fourth forge unlocked. Who knows? We'll have to wait and I will update you when more information comes out. If this video helped out guys, go ahead and give it a like. Newcomers to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button for some more D2 content like this coming out daily.